legit or nah. The Minnesota Twins beat the White Sox today. They are now 7-4 on the season. The Twins currently have an MLB leading run differential of plus 25. That is insane. Indeed, Dylan. What? Is it legit or not oh. to say that the Twins can contend in the AL Central with the Indians who went to the World Series a year ago? I mean, I don't think so, right? I I'm going to say nah. I, 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 I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to count on the fact that it's still so early in the season. It's still cold in a lot of places. Bats haven't exactly heated up, and, and the Twins have played great baseball. You know, whether it's Sano or Kepler, Buxton, there's so many guys that have really kind of got out of the gates pretty well, and no one better than the guy who started today, Irvin Santana, who was wow. fantastic, giving up one run in 21 innings pitched so far this season. So he's pitched with a lot of confidence. He's been the ace at the top of that staff, but I can't think it's going to continue. I, I mean, if we're sitting here at the All-Star break and the Twins – even have a plus run differential, let alone leading the league in run differential, I'd be shocked. I, I, look, I think we see this a lot, whether it's individuals that get off the surprising starts or individuals that we expect to get off the hot starts and get out slumping. That's what we're seeing here. You, I think with both the Indians slumping right now on a team scale and, and the Twins playing great, it, it, it's been great. It, it, it's been brilliant, and, and I'm sure Twins fans are ecstatic about the overachieving start. But to think it's going to stay this way when they just don't have the horses, I, I, I can't think it's going to happen. I'm going to say nah. Um, we saw two years ago the Twins kind of shocked the league, not by yep. making a playoff yep. spot or anything, but by playing really well when they have a, a minuscule payroll and not a lot of talent. They played really well. Last year they came back to earth. We're the worst team in baseball. Um, I, I Maybe they won't be the worst team in baseball this year, but I think it's going to be closer to that when it's all said and done and the dust, dust settles of this year. It's going to be closer to that than it was two years ago where they were still in contention in September. I Late don't think that's going to happen. Yeah, certainly you just have to wonder over 162 games, can you count on those young guys? Miguel Sano, still a 20-year-old guy. Max Kepler, Byron Buxton, you know, can those guys do it over an extended period of time? They could probably give you stretches, sure. but when you have young players, they will hit a wall. And Irvin, you kind of expect a performance like this from Irvin, but what about Phil Hughes and some of those other guys? The pitching staff are really where I have the big questions yeah. because those Buxtons and Sano's and Kepler's, they're high draft picks and guys that have a lot of talent. Talent. And maybe we will see them take that leap forward we haven't totally seen, especially from Buxton. Sano has been a consistent performer, yeah. and Kepler had a great second half of last year. But Buxton is struggling. Buxton has had some issues. Without a doubt. We've yeah. seen him just not be able to hit at this level. <laughs> right? And we know he can run, but just not be able to hit. Hopefully that changes for them offensively. Even if all of that stays the way it's been offensively, yeah. I don't think they have the pitching to compete with Cleveland. Once Cleveland starts getting going and Carrasco kind of figures it out, Salazar, we saw Kluber get... Uh, hit around a little bit today, even though they won that game. Those guys will settle in. Those numbers in the back of their baseball cards will return to form as the weather gets a little warmer and, and we get a little further into the season. I think it's the Indians' division to lose. I can see the Tigers competing, but beyond that, I don't see the Twins competing for a spot in the Central or a wild card spot when it's all said and done. Really, by the turn of, of May into June, <laughs> I don't see it. Certainly, it has been a great story so far. We'll have to see what happens going forward for the Twins.